have a ship that I know quite well. <laughs> uh, we got this ship on a video. Um, God, right at the beginning of the Sea-Doo season, one of the first ones I got whilst being on the Sea-Doo. And it was uh, the Frontenac. And she was coming out of here, out of Port Coburn, and she just, the smoke coming out of her uh, stacks was just brilliant to capture. Uh, anyway, she's here in Port Coburn right now, and uh, she looks like she's, uh, I'm gonna guess, unloading. <laughs> so I'm gonna presume she's, she's coming from Sault Ste. Marie. So would that be wheat up that way? Grain, wheat? So she's here unloading by the looks of it. So we'll go in, have a, a closer look. But I also want to show you a very sad sight just across from her and a little story which is... <laughs> Actually, I'll tell you about it right now. On Monday, which was five days ago, I woke up thinking, you know what, on my day off on Friday, I'm going to come out to Port Coburn. I want to get the drone. I want to be here like five o'clock in the morning and get some really early morning shots of uh, Algoma Transport uh, before they start scrapping her. Uh, get some nice, really, really good artistic shots with the sun being low, just coming up and stuff like that. Oh no, it didn't happen. Uh, right here in Niagara, YouTube channel based down here, uh, managed to get some shots and they've removed the stacks off her. So I had to scrap that idea. something at long last. It's extremely loud down here, as you can tell. It's coming from that, not the ship. supposed to be like that someone telling me if this is supposed to be like this or is it just bulged out or what I mean check this out yeah. want to get too close. All right, let's go to the back end of it and have a look. Yeah, it sticks out like a sore thumb. It's the only bit. It's the only bit of the ship I see that sticks out.
scratches along the way, you can tell at the back. something about a ship with the bridge at the front just looks so cool it, it just really identifies a great classic great lakes liner basically freighter i should say 